Hey guys, it's Ben Rob0329, and today, Cubic Two Sub Sim 2, and I have built a rather interesting house for, to show you guys today. Um, and what we'd like to call it is the Mies House, or the Concept Mies House, because it's hopefully the start of a new sort of type of video that we see on YouTube, which is similar to the Piston House in Minecraft, where essentially you try to pack in as many gadgets as you can into a build. So let's get started. To start off with, we have ourselves a fancy gate here, where if you place on a Misan torch, it will pull everything down. And then it just launched back up. And the pressure place will activate it as well. And then you can see it here. Then up next, the door is really nothing fancy, it's just standard pressure plate door, but there's no visible miscons, and we're going to go into that later, how we did that. Once inside the house, you can see that we have some chests and things. Over here we have our smelted chest, and here we have our grind and smelt chest, where if you put uh, ore lumps in, it will grind them. In Technic, if you grind an ore lump first, it will give you double the output, so then it transfers it over to the smelting chest. You can see we have plenty of wrought iron dust in there, and smelts it before putting it back into the mithril chest. We also have our battery box to tell us how much power we have, and our switch box to tell us how much supply and demand we have. Up next we have a hidden staircase. As you can see up here we have some solar panels as well as some beds some storage, as well as a Mistech teleporter, and a sign to tell you the exact coordinates, which actually needs to be updated because it's wrong, but anyways. The stairs also come included with a built-in upstairs switch thing, so you can open and close them from up there, which is really handy. Up next is the basement, and if we come over here, we can hit this button to summon the piston elevator which is a little slow going back down, so most of the time I just drop down, but it works good for going back up. So as you can see here, we have our battery boxes, along with our smelting system, as well as a prisoner. Now you may be wondering, what does this prisoner do? Well, he trades with you. Now I'm assuming he probably has some sort of Star Trek style uh, replicator tech so that he can turn the gold bars that would otherwise be unedible and would in fact be toxic to you into whatever the heck he needs because otherwise he's just gonna die down here which would be bad because it'd stink up the whole house could yeah. be an alien that doesn't need food can't can't have that <laughs> but he also hides secret for us because if we place down this torch, oh. which leads to the behind the scenes video over on Cubix's channel where we explain all of the MISCON stuff that we've done as well as some other MISCONs related stuff. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, please hit that like button and comment down below for what you'd like to see in the next video. Thanks for watching.